Hello, I'm Marcelo and on this tutorial we will learn how to run white path automations on macOS. So if you already searched in the past about doing it, probably you noticed that you can't install white path studio on macOS because it isn't supported at least until the moment that I'm recording this tutorial and also that you can't run any kind of automation like you can on Windows. So for Mac, it's only supported uh, white path automations which are cross platform. So now let's learn how we can run white path automations on macOS. So to run white path automations on macOS, first we need to install white path assistant. And to download it, let's uh, access to our YPath Automation Cloud account. So you just have to navigate to cloud.ypath.com and log in with your account. Then when we are here, let's click here on this button. And now let's click on the downloads option. And here we can see some items that we can download. And what matters to us is the system for macOS. So we have the system for enterprise version and also for the community version. So this is the one that we will install for the community version. And so we have an installer for Intel CPUs and Apple Silicon. So if your Mac has an Intel CPU, you just click on the first option. Else, if you have Apple Silicon, uh, you download from the second options. So because I have Apple Silicon, I will click here on the second one and the download will start. So now let's just wait it to finish. Download finishes. So let's open the installer and to install the white path assistant, we just have to drag the white path assistant here to the applications folder. So now it will be installed. So if we go here to the launch pad and search for white path assistant here, we can see it. So let's execute it. And on the first time that you try to open white path assistant, we'll be asked if you want really to open uh, the application. So you just click on open. So now we have to sign in into our account. So we just have to click here on sign in. And now here on the page that was open on the browser, Let's click on allow. So sign in done successfully and we can confirm that by looking here to this green light. And if we hover it, we can see that it says that we are connected to the orchestrator tenant. So now let's develop Hello World automation. So it will be a cross platform one. So we can execute it on macOS. And to create it, we'll use Studio Web as we can install and use YPath Studio on macOS. So to access Studio Web, we just go here to Automation Cloud. And now here, let's click on Studio. And now let's click on New Project. And let's define the project name, Hello World. And let's click Create. So let's just use a log message. Let's keep it simple. And now let's here define the message hello world. And let's just define the log level. So that's it. Let's publish our automation. So let's press publish. So now here we can add a description and now choose the workspace where we want to publish this project. So let's publish to the personal workspace feed and let's press now in publish. So it was published successfully and we can confirm that if we go to orchestrator. And now if we go to the my workspace folder, here we can see the project that we have published right now. So now if we go to YPath Assistant and here we can see the published automation. So let's try to run it. So let's press here on this button. So it was already executed. And now if we go here to jobs, here we can see that was 
executed successfully. So here we can see the hello world. So that we have executed a few seconds ago. And if we go here to the logs, here we can see so the execution started, hello world log message, and then the execution ended. And that was it for this tutorial. And if you liked it, please give a thumbs up. And also make sure you subscribe to the channel and enable the notifications bell so you will not miss any tutorial released here on the channel.